Get a grip, then get a chip. Won't even trip. Though my cup was running over, I took only a sip. Stay hipping, then I'm hopping, I'm dropping. It won't be flopping, no shock. That whatever I'm selling, you will be copping. He was the strongest, though he was the one that cried. And he chose to kill his brother, because he was from that side. And why? He chose this son, because this one had pride. And instead of the narrow road, he chose the one that's why. Sometimes the one that won was the one that tried. And the one who pulled the gun was the one that died. Looking good, a good look is the one that's fine. If I had to pick, fly would be the one that's mine. G-O-D, in the place to be. Attend the heart, not university. And since kindergarten, they've been hiding the knowledge. Homeboy is self-taught, never went to college. I'm brown skin, I'm from Pilon. Rainy alarm, but I remain cool and calm. Reading song, fire like napalm bomb. As we proceed to give you what you need, we are in the information age on Do You Know Your Value page. It's the content created with force like Darth Vader. Back on the track with the facts and all that. One path is the way that I'm taking, getting close to the guard in a tight situation. Tonight, we're going to continue going over the annotated glossary from Cracking the Code 3rd Edition. Actually, this will be our last video for the annotated glossary from Cracking the Code 3rd Edition. And we're going to be starting where we left off. And so without further ado, we will start at transmit. Transmit, send across, equivalent to trans, to send, to convey or pass along, an impulse, force, motion, etc. Webster's, see, convey, transferred for value. See UCC 3303, value and consideration. Transmit utility. Transmit utility means a means a person primarily engaged in the business of any of the following. A, operating a railroad, subway, street rail, railway, or trolley bus. B, transmitting communications electronically, electromagnetically, or by light. C, transmitting goods by pipeline or sewer. D, transmitting or producing and transmitting electricity steam, gas, or water, UCC 9102A80, filing office for transmitting utilities, the office in which to file a financing statement to perfect the security interest and collateral, including fixtures of a transmitting utility, is the office of, is the office of the Secretary of State, UCC 9501B, transmit utility financing statement. If a debtor is a transmitting utility and a filed financing statement so indicates the financing statement is effective until a termination statement is filed. UCC 515F, C note, transmit utility. Note, we all use in some degree electricity, steam, gas, water, telephone service, sewer service, etc. in our life. The bills for these services come in the trade name of our straw man, but we are the ones who must pay. These services are assessed, in other words, transmitted by virtue of the straw man trade name, in whose all capital letters written fictitious name. We have a nexus with the public venue. Your straw man interfaces between you and the public industrial society. He transmit on your he transmits on your behalf from the public venue into the private venue all manner of services that are available only from the public venue via artificial person trade names. In other words, straw man whose names appear in all capital letters. The term utility in patent law means industrial value. The capability of being so applied in practical affairs as to prove advantageous in the ordinary pursuits in life or add to the enjoyment of mankind. Flesh and blood men and women can enjoy value from the industrial community that is conveyed, sent, transferred, transmitted for their use by a transmitting utility. The proper venue for filing when the debtor is a transmitting utility, including fixtures, goods, intimately related with real property, is the Office of the Secretary of State, per both revised Article 9 UCC 9501 and previous Article 9 UCC 9, 4015, and not the county recorder's office, as with all other types of debtor filings. However, anyone with real estate holdings should also file a financial statement in the office of the county recorder clerk wherein the real estate is located. Also, there is nothing prohibiting anyone from refiling, recording such filing in the office of the county clerk recorder if desired. Under revised Article 9, the location of the debtor, note, not the collateral, is the proper jurisdiction for almost all filings. But in case of any doubt, a filing could be filed in any jurisdiction where collateral is located as well. 
per revised Article 9, UCC 9307, individual debtors are considered located at the individual's residence. Corporations and limited partnerships are located in their state of organization. The transmitter utility filing is also permanent per both revised Article 9, UCC 9515F and previous Article 9, UCC 94036 and need not be renewed every five years like other types of filings. More evidence that this route constitutes remedy. See straw man. Traverse. In the language of pleading, a traverse signifies a denial. Thus, where a defendant denies any material allegations of fact in the plaintiff's declaration, he is said to traverse it. And the plea itself is thence frequently termed a traverse. Blacks first. See traverser. Traverser in pleading, one who traverses or denies. A prisoner or party indicted, so-called from his traversing the indictment. True, conformable to fact, correct, exact, actual, genuine, honest. In one sense, that only is true, which is conformable to the actual state of things. In that sense, a statement is untrue, which does not express things exactly as they are. But in another and broader sense, the word true as a synonym of honest, sincere, not fraudulent. See Blacks first. True bill. In criminal practice, the endorsement made by a grand jury upon a bill of indictment, when they find it sustained by the evidence laid before them and are satisfied with the true with the truth of the accusation. Blacks first see note. Note a true bill, both in criminal practice and in commerce, is a ledgering, a bookkeeping, accounting, with every entry established via affidavit, certified and sworn on the responsible party's commercial liability as true, correct, and complete. And always contain and is and always contains and is characterized by a one-to-one -one correspondence between items, services purchased, and offenses committed, and the corresponding debt owed. This commercial relationship is what is known as just compensation. Fifth Article of Amendment of the Constitution. In the relationship between the government and the pe and the American people, a true bill is called a warrant. Fourth Article of Amendment of the Constitution. In the direct taking of property by legislative act. Example given. By the Federal Reserve's Internal Revenue Code, it's called a Bill of Pains and Penalties. Constitution Article 1, Section 10, Clause 1, and Article 1, Section 9, Clause 3, Bill of Attainder. True name. When a defendant is indicted or prosecuted by a fictitious or erroneous name, and in any stage of the proceedings his true name is discovered, it must be inserted in the subsequent proceedings, referring to the fact of his being charged by the name mentioned in the indictment or information. Oklahoma Statute, Chapter 22, Subsection 403, 17B. If you check the yes box in line 17A, give applicants true name and trade name if different than name shown on prior application. Internal Revenue Service Form SS4, revised April 1991. Application for Employer Identification Number. Please tell us about yourself. Use your true full name. California Department of Motor Vehicles Form Driver's License 44. Driver's License or Identification Card Application. See note, legal fiction, compare fictitious name. Note, the term true name is used whenever such inclusion may benefit actors in government, but it's not specifically defined as such in the law dictionaries that government actors draw from. Defining blacks forth within the definition of another term, fictitious name, see fictitious name, per the rules of English grammar and the prescriptions of law, only initial letters of the name of men, women, a proper noun are capitalized. The combination of one's Christian given name plus one's family name, surname, when written in this manner, constitute one's true name. Newspapers, when naming defendants and those convicted of a crime, always properly state the true name in proper English of the targeted party. Names falling outside the rules of English grammar are artificial constructs and exist only by force or in contemplation of law. In other words, are corporate, corporately colored, governmental, judicial use of an all caps Spelling is a presumption irrespective of the facts. See legal fiction. A true name, like a trade name, is property and can be copyrighted. Appellation is a superior concept regarding both true name and trade name and must be grasped to enjoy sovereignty. Trust fund, the property held in a trust by a trustee, Blacks 7. Trust fund doctrine, the principle that the assets of an insolvent company, including paid and unpaid subscriptions to the capital stock, are held as a trust fund to which the company's creditors may look for payment of their claims. Blacks 7th, Truth in Lending Act. This regulation, known as Regulation Z, is issued by the Board of Governors of the Federal Reserve System to implement the Federal Truth in Lending Act, which is contained in Title I of the Consumer Credit Protection Act 
as amended, 15 U.S.C. 1601 at sec. The consumer may exercise the right to rescind until men out of the third business day following consummation, delivery of the notice required by paragraph B of this section, or delivery of all material disclosures, whichever occurs last. Title 12, Code of Federal Regulation, Code of Federal Regulations, Chapter 2. Part 226, Truth in Lending, Regulation Z. UCC, Uniform Commercial Code. UCC, Subsection 1103, Supplementary General Principles of Law Applicable. Unless displaced by the particular provision of this code, the principles of law and equity, including the law merger and the law relative to capacity to contract, principal and agent, estoppel, fraud, misrepresentation, duress, coercion, mistake, bankruptcy, or other validating or invalidating cause shall supplement its provisions. UCC subsection 1104, construction against implicit repeal. This code being a general act intended as a unified coverage of its subject matter, no part of it shall be deemed to be impliedly repealed by, by subsequent legislation if such construction can reasonably be avoided. UCC, see note. No, nothing in the UCC has ever been repealed, nor can it ever be. In the event of a conflict, in the event of conflict between a deleted section and the current section, the deleted section controls. If this is examined, one will see that it cannot be any other way. Potentially countless commercial transactions can be consummated based on the current UCC at any given time. To cancel any portion of the UCC at a later point is to throw into upheaval and chaos all commercial agreements that were based on the deleted portion an act that will carry unimaginably astronomical liability for any of the actors who attempted to effect such change. Ultravise, unauthorized, beyond the scope of power allowed or granted by a corporate charter or by law, Black Seventh. Uniform Commercial Code, UCC, one of the uniform laws drafted by the National Conference of Commissioners on Uniform State Laws and the American Law Institute governing commercial transactions, including sales and leasing of goods, transfer of funds, commercial paper, bank deposits and collections, letters of credit, bulk transfers, warehouse receipts, bills of lading, investment securities, and secure transactions. The UCC has been adopted in whole or subsequently by all states, or substantially by all states, Black Six. A code of laws governing various commercial transactions, including the sale of goods, banking transactions, secure transactions, and personal property, and other matters, that was designed to bring uniformity in these areas to the laws of the various states and that has been adopted with some modification in all states as well as in the district of columbia and in the virgin islands barons third unless displaced by the particular provisions of this code the principles of law and equity including the law merchant and the law relative to the past to capacity to contract principal and agent estoppel fraud misrepresentation duress coercion mistake bankruptcy or other validating or invalidating cause shall supplement its provisions. UCC 1103C note. Note, to paraphrase the third definition above, the UCC is the supreme codified law on the planet, and all other forms of law are encompassed by it and included in it. Pennsylvania was the first state to adopt the UCC, July 1st, 1954, and Louisiana the last, January 1st, 1975. United States. United States means A, a federal corporation. 28 United States Code, subsection 3002, 15, chapter 176. It is clear that the United States is a corporation. 534 Federal Supplement 724. The United States of America is a corporation endowed with the capacity to sue and be sued to convey and receive property. Bouvier's Law Dictionary, 5th edition. This term has several meanings. It may be merely the name of a sovereign occupying a position analogous to that of other sovereigns in the family of nations. It may designate territory over which sovereignty of the United States extends, or it may be collective name of the states which are united by and under the Constitution Black Six. The United States government is a foreign corporation with respect to a state. 19 Corpus Juris Secundum, Secundum subsection 884. And regarding Miriam's estate, 36 New York 505 141 New York 479 affirmed in US versus Perkins 163 US 625. What is included in terms of United States and possessions of the United States? Hawaii and Alaska are included in the term United States. Puerto Rico, the Virgin Islands of the United States, the Philippines, Archipelago, Guam, Tutalia, and Manua, and other islands of the Samoan group east of longitude 171 west of Greenwich 
and the canal zone are included in the term possessions of the United States. United States Official Postal Guide, July 20, July 1929. The code has become one of the United States' important exports. The ABCs of the UCC by Russell A. Hakes, 2000. See note, District of Columbia, in this state, bankruptcy, compare United States of America. Note, it is well settled that United States is a corporation originally incorporated February 21st, 1871, under the name District of Columbia. Reorganized, reorganized, reorganized June 11th, 1878. A bankrupt organization per House Joint Resolution 192 on June 5th, 1933, Senate Report 93-549. And Executive Orders 6072, 6102, 6111, and 6246. A de facto, see de facto government. Originally the 10 mile square track seated by Maryland and Virginia and comprising Washington, D.C., plus the possessions, territories, forts, docks, and arsenals tracked from Virginia was retroceded in 1846. It is also abundantly clear that in postal matters, the term United States is a political entity distinct from the 50 freely associated compact states, the several states of the Union. From the last site in the definition above, one can also see that the United States is a singular proper noun, just as corporate General Motors is not plural, neither is corporate United States. For a corporate history of the United States Incorporated, see demise of the American Constitution, see demise of the American Constitutional Republic in appendix. United States Code, a multi-volume published codification of federal statutory law. In a citation, it is abbreviated as USC, as in 42 USC subsection 1983, Blacks 7th. United States Notes, Promissory Notes, Resembling Bank Notes, Issued by the Government of the United States, Blacks 6. Compare Federal Reserve Notes, C. Note. Note, the last president to print United States Notes was JFK. Lincoln, Garfield, McKinley, and Kennedy were assassinated for the same reason. They were making significant changes in the monetary system. Assassinations were attempted on other presidents by the same people for the same reason, but were unsuccessful. United States of America. The republic whose organic law is the constitution adopted by the people of the 13 states that declared their independence of the government of Great Britain on the 4th day of July, 1776. If the nation comes down from its position of sovereignty and enters the domain of commerce, it submits itself to the same laws of commerce that govern individuals therein. It assumes the position of ordinary citizen and it cannot recede from the fulfillment of its obligations. Who be its eighth? Federal Republic formed after the War of Independence and made up of 48 conterminous states, plus the state of Alaska and the District of Columbia in North America, plus the state of Hawaii in the Pacific, Blacks 7. All were pertaining to or founded upon and organized by a compact or act of union between separate sovereign states as one by a league for common interest and defense as regards external relations, the internal sovereignty of each member remaining unimpaired as the Hanseanic League or the German Confederation, or two, by a permanent act of union founded on the consent of the people duly expressed, constituting the government supreme within the sphere of the powers granted to it by that act of union. As the United States of America, the Constitution of the United States of America is of a very different nature than that of the German Confederation. It is not merely a league of sovereign states for their common defense against external and internal violence, but a supreme federal government or compositive state acting not only upon the sovereign members of the union, but directly upon all its citizens in their individual and corporate capacities. We in Elements International Law, subsection 52, page 78. From 1776 to 1789, the United States were a confederation. After 1789, it was a federal nation, excerpted from the definition of federal and standard dictionary of the English language. Funk and Wagner's Company, 1903, Compare United States District of Columbia, C. Note, Clearfield Trust Doctrine. Contrimonious, the first sense, sharing a common boundary. In the second sense, enclosed with a common boundary. Blacks, seventh. Note, notice that the 1903 Funk and Wild Niles affirms that the term United States was a plural designation between 1776 and 1789, but that after 1789, it was similar. It was singular. USC, C. United States something useful, a useful thing. Webster's, 
Utility is said to be absence of frivolity and mischievousness and utility for some beneficial purpose. And the degree of utility is not material. Bovier's eighth, C, transmitting utility. A value to be worth, equivalent worth or returning money, material, services, etc. Webster's, a person's value, a person gives value for rights if he or she acquires them in any of the following ways. A, in return for a binding commitment to extend credit or for the extension of immediately available credit, whether or not drawn upon and whether or not a chargeback is provided for in the event of difficulties in collection. B, as security for or in total or partial satisfaction of a pre-existing claim. C, by accepting delivery pursuant to a pre-existing contract for purchase. D, generally in return for any consideration sufficient to support a simple contract. UCC 120144A, an instrument is issued or transferred for value if any of the following apply. In the third sense, the instrument is issued or transferred as security for antecedent claim against any person. UCC 3303A3, C note. Note, a necessary provision of law is remedy. C, remedy. The operation of acceptance for value is, by deduction, remedy. When you file... When you file a UCC financing statement and redeem your original birth document and claim the straw man's trade name, no one can dispute, challenge the claim, and title passes. You have, by definition, the supreme right to reclaim title of the birth certificate straw man and trade name over all others because its very existence is derived entirely from you, thereby evidencing value. In fact, every one of the above definitions applies directly in the case of you and your trade name. A good exercise will be to work through all the definitions until you understand how the value aspect applies. Subparagraphs A, B, and C of the sample private agreement offered herein are taken directly from the above definitions of value. Once you fully understand how you have given and continue to give value, you will know how you acquire your rights. And you will also achieve an unshakable certainty of your true standing in a societal scheme of things. The fact that you have given value is confirmed and tactically acknowledged and validated by government in its silence and registration of the UCC financing statement, among other things, the instrument, your birth document, the instrument, your birth document is transferred, redeemed by you as security for an antecedent claim against any person, your trade name based on your pre-existing claim, see acceptance by silence, remedy, presumption, vehicle, that in or on which persons, goods, etc., may be carried from one place to another, especially along the ground that which is used as an instrument of conveyance, transmission, or communication. Term refers to every device in, upon, or by which a person or property is or may be transported upon a highway. Blacks 6. C. Note. Note. Per the definition, per the above definition, a transmitting utility is a straw man, is a vehicle. Another definition of vehicle is inland vessel and admiralty. C. Vessel, admiralty. Vessel. The term vessel in admiralty law is not limited to ships or vessels engaged in commerce. Blacks 6. C. Note. Res. Note. In admiralty, names of vessels are designated in all capital letters. Whenever you appear in any public forum, it is always via your straw man, your all capital letters vessel, much like an officer stands on the bridge of his ship and sails it into port. All law is now, is now admiralty maritime, and you can no longer go into court as a man or woman only by selling your vessel into the jurisdiction of the court. Everyone speaks from his or her vessel with one vessel officer transacting with another. Each is trying to get the other officer to recognize the condition of his or her vessel. In other words, it's registration. If a vessel, if a vessel is unregistered on the high seas in time of war, it is presumed, assumed to be a pirate vessel to be confiscated and investigated. If the vessel is registered, the exact issue is with which public entity it is registered. Your straw man is a transmitting utility, is a vessel, is an inland vessel, and admiralty is a public vessel, is a vehicle. In times of war now, neutral vessels, trade names, require passports. See public vessel passport. Vice Admiralty Courts in English law. Courts establishing the Queen's possessions beyond the seas with jurisdiction over maritime causes, including those relating to prize. See note, prize, prize law, booty. No, all courts in America are vice admiralty courts and the Crown's private commerce. See note, barratry. Voluntary surety. See surety. Voluntary surety ship. See surety ship. War. Hostile conflict by means of armed forces carried on between nations, states, or rulers, or sometimes by parties within the same nation or state, a period of such conflict. 
Black's seventh. See note. Note, the above definition includes the war currently being conducted by the U.S. government against the American people as sureties of their citizen of the United States trade name as declared in the Mandatory Act, March 9, 1933, to the, trading with the Amen- to the Trading with the Enemy Act of October 6, 1917. See Trading with the Enemy Act of October 6, 1917. War Contribution. International Law. An extraordinary payment imposed by an occupying power on the population of an occupied territory during wartime. Blacks 7th. See note. Note, Social Security payroll taxes are war contributions. See contribution. Ponzi scheme. War mixed. See mixed war. War powers. See trading with the enemy act of October 6, 1917. Wards of the court. Infants and persons of unsound mind. Blacks 4th. Note, poor corpus juris secundum clients of attorneys are wards of the court, thereby also qualifying them as persons of unsound mind, non compos mentis. See client, attorney, and client. Warehouseman. A warehouseman is a person engaged in the business of storing goods for hire. UCC 7102H. See note, goods. Note, some birth certificates have two sets numbers printed on the back of them. One of the numbers identifies the state warehouse district where the birth took place. The state is the warehouse. Each county is a warehouse district. The governor is the main warehouse man. The county recorder of each county is the district warehouse man. The birth certificate is a warehouse receipt and a failed warehouse receipt. It is also a dock receipt. The ship, the vessel, and admiralty. The trade name was birth, birth at a specific warehouse hospital in a specific warehouse district county, and the goods your body were delivered therein. See warehouse receipt, field warehouse receipt, delivery. Warehouse receipt, a receipt issued by a person, barely engaged in the business of storing goods for hire, UCC 1, subsection, UCC subsection 120145. A warehouse receipt constitutes a document of title under the Uniform Commercial Code, which evidences that the person in possession of the document is entitled to receive, hold, and dispose of the document and the goods it covers, UCC subsection 120115. A warehouse receipt may be a negotiable instrument depending on its terms. Baron's third. A warehouse receipt or other document of title is negotiable. A. If by its terms the goods are to be delivered to bearer or to the order of a named person. Or B. Where recognized in overseas trade if it runs to a named person or assigns. UCC 71041. C. Field warehouse receipt. Former California Civil Code, subsection 1858.04. Wholesale. To sell by wholesale, to sell by large parcels, generally in original packages and not by retail. Blacks first, compare retail. Note, the U.S. government acquired birth certificate, strawman titles, and wholesale bulk purchase. And at this moment in time, we're going to stop because we, we also have, we have another video with the Wizard of Oz. And the Wizard of Oz, that definition is about five pages long. And we have a video with the Wizard of Oz. You could go look that up at any point in time when it's convenient for you to look it up. And that is basically the end of the annotated glossary. Like, share, comment, and subscribe, people. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you like it. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I definitely enjoyed going over the annotated glossary with you folks. And understand, you can't make a shot you don't take. So take the shot. And with that, I'm going to say be peaceful, stay blessed, and pray to pass God's test. And I will talk with you guys later.